Hey, hey everyone, welcome back. In this video, we are continuing on with a stair nosing installation onto a landing. So you can see here that we have the stair nosing um, and it has been cut. You'll notice that the flat part is a little bit longer because it needs to cover uh, the whole length of the landing after the nosing part there. So um, it, that's cut and that is glued into place just like any other stair nosing uh, step that we would do. Um, but in this situation, Situation, the best part about these nosings is that they still have their click on it so uh, once you have that nosing in place you're able to click another board onto it um, really really important when you're doing this you'll notice that you're always holding that nosing into place so anytime you're adding pressure to the other boards to do the installation um, and especially if it, it's a type of system that you have to use a mallet um, always make sure that you have that reverse pressure coming from the nosing um, so that that's not getting pushed out of place so in this video we're obviously cutting the boards to the length that's needed um, in this case we don't want to be walking on the other stairs that have been installed recently so um, we got them all cut ahead of time and had them there so we're not going up and down for that process uh, this is life proof vinyl from Home Depot that we're using it has a really nice locking system we really love working with it um, and you can see here it's quite easy uh, to be getting down and into place and you'll again notice that um, he's just holding those existing boards that are there to make sure that there's no reverse pressure going on for um, the the nosing that's there so uh, again you continue just adding your boards it does start to get a little bit tight in that back corner as you go but again a reminder you're going to be putting trim around all of this um, so it doesn't need to be a super tight fit um, you can be leaving that quarter inch out there that your your trim is going to cover so uh, this last one is a little tricky you got to just drop it into place and then he uses this to kind of lever it in and make sure that the click is joined up there it's so important when you're picking out your vinyl that you do look at the clicking systems making sure that they're they're easy enough for you to work with especially in those tight corners because you always do end up in them so here is the finished product you see that uh, beginning staircase and then that vinyl just continuing straight into that landing no lips no transitions uh, absolute beautiful finish there Please, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button to see more of this project. The staircase does continue and we'll be bringing you more content daily. Have a good one.